I'm here with Dan Park again, and we are looking at RFID solutions, and in particular, the application of RFID. Now, Dan, let's start with retail. How can retailers benefit from an RFID solution? Well, stock take um, is an important uh, function within retail organisations. It takes a lot of time to you know, count every item, scan every item with a barcode. Um, RFID makes short work of that. And if you think of high value items such as mobile phones, they may want to take stock take on them once a week or even once a night. So, you know, traditional barcode scanning will just be too slow and tedious. So having RFID tags on all your mobile phones in that department, you can make short work of scanning all those items with a RFID gun. We know in healthcare environments, there are a lot of assets that need to be tracked. How can RFID assist? Yeah, asset tracking is very important with healthcare. Um, a good example of this is in Thailand, there's a very large hospital that currently uses RFID to track their linen so they know um, what's getting washed and, and where it is at any point in time, and also it minimizes wastage and, and maximizes uh, usage of their assets. Now, what about manufacturing? Well, manufacturing, not only are assets important to be managed, but also um, their materials. So um, we have uh, a location solution called uh, Modal, uh, Motionworks, which has a, um, a segment called Motionworks Material, which is designed to track all your items, all your material items within the, uh, you know, the manufacturing process. Um, we also can track the assets, such as forklifts as well, using the same RFID technologies. And manufacturing leads into warehousing. Yep. Yeah, RFID is very important with, with um, transport and logistics and warehousing as well. So when you're receiving goods, you, you, there might be a case where you have antennas around the, um, the entry points um, leading, hooked into an RFID reader. So you know exactly what's coming into your warehouse and what's going out at any point in time. You've covered a lot of the traditional uses of RFID in known industries. What about some of those other areas where we're seeing RFID coming into play? Yeah, look, one of the more um, common use cases is in retail. Um, yeah, particularly apparel because it's a very obvious and easy use case. But some other use cases would include ticketing, such as at ski resorts where you, you know, get it, have a ticket to get onto a chairlift. Um, airports use it on baggage. Um, and even you know, um, art galleries use it on expensive items within the gallery. There are a lot of use cases for RFID technology, but in a nutshell, how would you summarise when to consider using RFID? The best use cases for RFID are with high value items. Um, items that move around the warehouse a lot, for example, uh, fulfillment where you need to find that, that last item in the warehouse, um, and also for critical items such as in healthcare where you, know, you need to find something, you need to know where something is at a point in time. Thanks, Dan. Now, if you want to find out more about Zebra's RFID solution, jump online at zebra.com.